what what do you like most about being a journalist? Um, in, interestingly, I, I went into it uh, with a background in writing. I, I had a lot of jobs that, that involved writing of some sort, book publishing, mm -hmm. um, and and the like. And what I found is that I enjoy the most is actually the reporting, uh, just because. I meet so many interesting people, and I'm put into so many just unusual situations that um, most people in day-to-day -day life d don't get put into. And you know, especially in, in New York City, uh, you know, w one of my favorite assignments was <clears throat> it was about five years ago. I was uh, an intern for the Daily News, and I got sent to. Harlem because there was a report of a tiger in, in someone's apartment. I remember this. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, I got there and, you know, I, I'd been in the city for five years, but I hadn't spent a ton, ton of time in Harlem. And there were thousands of people on the streets. <laughs> there were police, there were reporters, there were cameras. It was like a circus, but, you know, my assignment, they, they gave me the specific assignment to, to find out whether, did, did people, the, the, you know, the story was this guy had a tiger living in his apartment in, in, in a housing complex. And my assignment was to find out whether, you know, did people know, did the neighbors know that this guy had, you know, how do you, how do you not know that there's a tiger right, right, right. living next door to you? So, um, you know, I, I just had license. Any anyone who was there, I had license to talk about it. And I mean, what what a fun topic to talk about. I mean, it was, <laughs> it was one of those only in New York kind of things. And yeah. what struck me was that even the the police officers who, you know, in public tend to tend to be very professional. They they looked like giddy school kids because it was the craziest thing you know <laughs> anyone had heard. So.